What's up everyone, this is Danny for DashAuto.com. Today I'm gonna to be doing a tutorial on how to remove 3M adhesive tape from your dash. We are using a um, glass window here, but imagine this as your car windshield. So in a situation where you bought a dash cam and maybe you wanna replace the dash cam with a new one, you're gonna to have to take the 3M adhesive tape off. So today we're gonna to show you how to do that. Um, over here we have the VOFO A129 and here we have the Power Magic Pro. Both stick down with adhesive tape. So what you need is, in the case that you're in your car garage, uh, is that you will need a blow dryer. First, I'm gonna show you how to do it improperly. So this is if you're just starting out with a dash cam, you probably have this in your box and you don't know how to take it off. This is what you probably be doing. I'm actually gonna try to take it off without a blow dryer first and see how that goes. One eternity later. Holy shit. I'm actually sweating right now. Oh, uh, and as you can see, it's still stuck on. <laughs> but I guess that's one way to go about it. So now I'm gonna show you how to take it off properly. So first, I'm gonna be plugging my blow dryer into an extension cord. If you're in a garage, this would be perfect. Also, you will need a pretty long extension cord if you're doing this from your garage. So you're gonna turn your blow dryer on high. So blow dry the back of it. So the goal is to get it as hot as you can. If you have a heat gun, it will even be better. So around around the one minute mark, you're gonna want to go to the other side and see how it is. Okay, so now we've been blow drying for about I say three minutes or so. And what you're gonna want to do is take it off now, and apply a little bit of pressure. It's not gonna be easy to take off, it's still gonna take a little bit of force, but as you can see the adhesive tape is peeling off rather easily. And look at that. As clean as you can get with no marks on the window. There is very little residue that's gonna be remaining on your windshield. Yeah. And you can place another dash cam in with ease. In case you watched this video too late and you already have adhesive tape all over your windshield, there's another trick you can use to remove the adhesive tape, and that is to find another piece of adhesive tape and 